Hello YouTube, Cancer Man Quintel Pro and Nun Variable 6. I'm doing something a little different today. Now, now it's going to have the same format as some of my other videos. However, this one is actually meant to be a comedy, kind of, so to speak. But let's take a look here. Um, I've got some comments that I'm a redhead has been posting to me on one of my videos and uh, the individual night sabers now I know a lot of people have their questions as to who night sabers is or what they're about or what's really going on with that uh, the thing that I'm really going to look at is night sabers dialogue with I'm a redhead uh, night sabers keeps calling I'm a redhead an older lady and it's really burning her ass it's really it's really getting to her pretty bad but anyway, Night Sabers posts a comment. Remember when Mr. Dragonfire made you cry? And I'm a Redhead's response was, Nope, because it never happened. He got trolled off YouTube. This is interesting. Do you remember one of my first videos that I ever made under the Here Be Monsters 6 channel when I first came onto YouTube? Well, when I first started posting videos? That. <clears throat> Do you remember I was actually standing up for you because you were crying on cam? Do you remember that, I'm a redhead? I'm sure other people in the class do. But, and, and, and your, your response was, um, he got trolled off YouTube. Well, actually, no, he didn't. Uh, he is still around, believe me. Um, I, I've actually uh, had a couple of accounts, you know, pop through, send me some messages, and I've been kind of leery as to who those individuals were. It's uh, coming, becoming clear to me um, who that is, and that that is in fact the um, the dragon fire. But we won't. We'll we'll continue to move forward. My response, because I did interject. Um, he is still here, very much so. <laughs> you're too stupid to see the angle that was played uh, but this is not about just smearing someone this is really about I I'm gonna actually show the I'm a redhead video that she posted in response to me when when I'm done with this which will be very soon um, prove me wrong I, I told her to prove me wrong and I called her a name and I'm not gonna say it on video if you wanna go look at it it's my um, I'll give you the title of the video. I'll put the uh, video in the description field. I'll put a link to it. Um, uh, some white trash comments being thrown around in there. I uh, said, I'm not white. This is I'm a redhead. I'm not white trash. Just wait and see what happens. You played Von Pedo like a fool, but guess what? You're losing. So why don't you go ahead and block me on this channel? You fucking pedo... I seen fucking vid dick weed. All right, now sh here we go. My response to I'm a redhead. You are very much, and I call her a name again. I will not block you because I have you where I want you. I wouldn't block you under any circumstances. I have you trapped now. Your compulsion forces you to remain here in an attempt to get the last word. I will destroy you, and you will have to leave on your own accord. How does it feel to be played by someone who knows you better than you know yourself? You leave when I let you. And I'm a redhead's response was, um, no, bye, see ya, wouldn't want to be ya, and she disappeared. So, <laughs> reverse psychology works very well on I'm a redhead. <laughs> that was my hypothesis. And through my experiment, I have come to the same conclusion. Hypothesis affirmed. <laughs> but... Let's take a look at I'm a Redhead's 
newest video. I'm going to have to show it to you though. You got to see this. Here we go. Let's see if we can get this to come up. Here we go. Here she comes. She's on her way, I promise. There she is. Let's see what she's got to say. <laughs> Yo, what up YouTube? I'm making this video to address KFC Man Contel Pro, aka Here Be Monster 7, aka Fucking Shit Stick, aka Faggot of the World, aka Pedophile. Anyway, um, he's begging me to make a fucking video about him. You know what? I might be ugly, and, you know, you're fucking whacked out of your fucking mind. At least I show my face on cam. I'm like your bitch ass self. That's where you're out of your mind. And you see, you show your face on here. Someone gets your face, they can get your name. Then they have your name and your face. So, think about what would have happened. Now we know that all that crazy girl email thing, that that was all wrong, that it was all false, that it was all fabricated. Everyone in the class knows it. Now think about this. Think about if I had showed my face on cam and given my name. You see, as of right now, my employers can Google my name and they won't find shit. Not even a Facebook. You know why? Because I don't have one. Okay? Nothing that you can say or do to me on here can stick, possibly. That is why I don't show my face. Now, some people can show their faces. Because they're good enough at what they do. <clears throat> Won't mention any names. But it's not you. I'm a redhead. It is not you. You think? Oh, we're gonna we're gonna continue. Oh, and as far as me being, what you say I was out of my mind or, or nuts or twisted, I am a little bit. I mean, come on. <laughs> Aren't we all just a little bit? But let's hear what else you got. Yeah. Well, you need to just fuck off. And what's the shit saying that I'm the reason why men beat their wives? You're a fucking moron. For fucking real. You're a fucking moron. And, you know. know the people I know, motherfuckers. You don't. Oh, I'm scared. <laughs> you don't know me. You don't know the people I know. Oh, you're going to get it. <laughs> you can't play poker if you're not holding any cards. And you can't play chess if you can't see the other person's pieces. I can see all of yours. So, yeah. After all of that, you ain't hurting me. And, um, yeah. I'm ugly. So fucking what? I'm, I'm not hurting you. Well, my point, I'm not actually trying to hurt you. I am simply retaliating against you. You attacked me, do you remember? Do you remember way back when, when you had the videos up on YouTube where you were crying on cam, and I was operating the Here Be Monsters 6 channel at the time, and I actually stood up for you? Do you remember that? Your response was to go onto my page and call me a quote-unquote fag. Yeah. You remember that? The class does. Yeah, they sure do. Absolutely. We all remember that. 
And it shows how weak you really are. That when someone stands up for you, and you side with the people who are attacking you, in order to try to gain some form of acceptance from them. Because you are that desperate to be accepted. That you would turn on someone who is trying to help you. In order to be accepted by those who you desperately want to be accepted by. How's that? For me hurting you? No. I'm simply letting you know what's happened, what has happened to you, how you have been manipulated, and how you've attacked the wrong person. And being who I am and what I do and what I'm about, I'm not going to take a pass on that. When that other channel came down, I remembered that other video went down too. And I, I kind of wanted to do that. And then when Tesla, Tesla <laughs> Tinkerbell, I posted that video about a month back saying that I demoralized you, uh, I decided back then that I wanted to do a video on this. But I really wanted to give you an opportunity to post some comments on my page. And to start saying some nasty things toward me. That way I could justify coming back at you like this. And I knew you would do it. I knew if I just waited for a while. For a short while. That you would come back onto my page. Realizing that I had a new channel where you weren't blocked. That you would come onto my page and start calling me a quote unquote fag. Or something like that again. So I waited. And I let you give me what I needed. In order for me to take the high ground. And to set you up. And to pull you right into this. And as far as the reverse psychology. I mean you have no idea how easy it was to get you to do this. But we're going to listen to what else you have to say. And do a quick little short rebuttal afterward. No oh, I am. <clears throat> but guess what? I get laid on my dear stupid ass motherfucking self. How many, how many? You get laid? Well I mean. Well I guess you could go up to the truck stop there. You probably know that place, don't you? You know that truck stop? You know? Just about a mile from where you live there? Hmm? Guys, have you gotten laid this year? Hmm, I got laid. Hmm. Seven. And they were all good. <laughs> More times than you can count, probably. Because you're so dumb, you probably can't count higher than motherfucking two. So, fuck off. Actually, seven. They weren't all good. Um, well, four of them were great, one of them was good, two of them were, eh, so-so. Ah, uh, dude, you don't even fucking know me, and, um, at least I ate a pussy, at least I show my face on cam, bitch. Don't use the excuse, oh, I can't show my face on cam because of work, because you know what, that excuse didn't work last time, motherfucker. We don't all work for the Waffle House. Some of us actually have positions where others would recognize us. Your ass is going to get handed to you. Fuck off, dude. At least I'm not a pedophile. At least I don't hit on fucking girl and try to fucking solicit minors on fucking YouTube. Have you been paying attention over the last month and a half or so? Dark Zodiac basically claimed that he did it You don't have the crazy girl 1127, right? You are really behind. You are way behind. You know what? I'm really not going to finish what you've got here. Um, because I'm not doing two videos on this. I'm not. I'm at 14 minutes, 27 seconds. I'm not doing another video on you. I just wanted to go ahead and give everybody an opportunity to see what you look like. Um, how ignorant you're capable of being. And what I've done. This is YouTube. Here be monsters. Still the unknown variable six cancer man going to hell, bro. I'll let you go because I'm sure you got to get back up to the truck stop. 